Okay, so I'm here with Heather. Hello. Um, we're going to be configuring the uh, Denali lights right now. So uh, for starters, we put our, our CanSmart underneath the, uh, the rear seat here. So just lift up on this, get this off. Slide that off there. And revealing the CanSmart module. Now you'll notice on here, there is a little small plug, and this is where your, um, your USB goes. So pull that out. Don't lose this, this is your waterproof connection. And also I do recommend people keep their, um, their bike on the tender uh, when doing this kind of work, just cause you don't want the, um, the bike to, you know, the battery to get so low in voltage that things gonna go haywire and you can ignore this for now though. Um, so uh, I'm gonna grab the USB cable and get right back to you guys. Okay, so all I'm doing is, uh, is this gonna reach? Yeah, kind of. Is I'm just plugging the, um, the micro USB cable into here. The bike is currently off. Okay, so Heather has the, uh, the easy can going. Yes. Now we're going to... Uh, yes, I want to open it. Now we're gonna tab over to, basically to her screen recording to make this a little bit better for you. Got over to Heather now, we're doing a voiceover. Yeah, so the CanSmart application was really easy to install. It was it's really easy to use. Um, I highly recommend just sort of messing around with it at first because you can turn the bike on to see, to confirm that the lights that you're changing are the lights that you think you're changing. But also, like I wasn't sure if I wanted the the really big uh, lights to be on during the day to any extent. Um, in some of these settings, I wasn't even sure what they meant for me in like a practical use situation. So as soon as you change the setting, as long as you turn the bike on, you can see what you changed. And then when you turn the bike off, you can change the settings again. I mean, it's really quick. Um, it's like instant gratification, which is nice. So. I thought it was really easy to app to use, and I mean, I'm pretty like tech savvy, I guess, but this was just a super simple app. Okay, so Heather has done some configurations. What's cool about this, we notice, is whenever, let's say she has um, the D7s, which are the top, which is the 10 amp setting, uh, set to like 50%. Um, and we can test that by clicking this on. 20% on the low and then 50% 50, 50 on the high. Now if we turn the bike off, this is so cool. Um, and then she makes a change where these are set to zero and these are set to, let's say, 75% of the bottom. Let me know when you're done. Yep. When I press this again. So zero and 70. Zero and 70. So that's pretty cool, which is like, you have that instant feedback on if your setting was adopted or not. You can kind of preview it first. Now remember, one thing to keep in mind when you're configuring this is in your TFT screen, it's hard to see here, but there's a little on the right side, on the top and bottom, there is a, um, a light sensor. And the light sensor is meant to actually tell your bike, it's nighttime, turn this light on, it's daytime, turn this light off. So you'll see on the Denali thing, there is a day intensity and night intensity. That's using the sensor. So if you, were, if you, would, if you want to test that and you want to set, make it think it's nighttime, just put your hand over the right side of the TFT there and it'll go to nighttime mode. Fun little hack there. Um, anything else that you, well, we can do the voiceover the other stuff. Okay, yeah, it's so, super easy. Yeah, like that, that's it. And then when you're done, uh, are you done configuring, honey? Yes. When you're done, um, just unplug this here. And then this little PC on your two hands need to go back into place to keep that um, uh, can smart weatherproof. But uh, yeah, that, that's that's it for configuration. There's not even really worth making a video on it, but no. I'll link to the download below to download the application. Cause it's kind of hard to find on Google, but yeah, that, that's the hardest part is finding the application. Everything else is a gravy.